Thank God it's the final part. Because so I'm about to lose my goddamn mind. <laughs> <laughs> wait. Hey, what? wait a minute. I've seen this before. <laughs> wait. <laughs> Did we skip something? <laughs> well, we're about to skip something now because the reason why the one of the many reasons why the Wii version is the worst version of this game is that it pulls a Sonic Unleashed and it skips a whole level. Oh. Right. But it shows all the cutscenes of that level. Oh. So we get so we get like eight we get like eight minutes worth of cutscenes right now. Oh, that's good. Oh, <laughs> should you like introduce everyone or no? No, we already did last part. Right, but okay. If you're coming in on part seven, go back and watch part one, you idiot. Do you know how <laughs> to count? But there's different people involved. <laughs> I'm missing in two parts. So, so in so an FTCR LP. <laughs> okay, whatever. Look, so did Barry just get an erection? I'm looking. It's Barry's mother. Sure. Oh. I think she has an erection too. <laughs> What's going this on underneath part... that circle? This was the part last time where somebody said we should read everything out on screen out loud, and I said Barry's father for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> we had the world's best LP group. So why? Never the subtitles read about. Why don't you buy a new? Why don't you get a different version? Why are we playing the Wii one? Because the Wii one's the worst version. Oh, okay. Because. The was Wii. It, was the Nintendo not... B. <laughs> was it not on the Game Boy Advance? It's... It was on the DS. Is that not the worst version? BS. <laughs> I don't know, I've never played it. Well, you should have done that one instead. Oh, so you can't say that the that the Wii version is the worst version <laughs> if you haven't played the 3DS version. <laughs> Okay, so B movie game 3D. Wait, what is going on? This doesn't happen in the movie. Nope. Again, this is all expanded material. Have you not seen the movie, David? I clearly remember this scene. <laughs> I remember him talking about jazz for at least 45 minutes. Uh, <laughs> wait. If yeah, that was that was in one of the parts that you weren't in. <laughs> Okay. And now, and now we have low rent good feathers. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, so this ever is ever since I was a little kid, I wanted to be a good feather. <laughs> <laughs> what be Sony Brussels sprouts? Such a lie. No, the 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 villain John Goodmoon's evil uh, plan in the game is that he wants to take all the honey and turn it into tasting like Brussels sprouts. Did you just say John Goodmoon? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's oh. enough coming today for one day. Alright, later. <laughs> waka waka! <laughs> oh man, I missed a lot. Haunt! <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. So, so, in the context of this game, John Goodman's character has literally hired these hornets to protect his stuff for him. Yes. Why? I, why would he do that? Because. He's a. Because. Because. <laughs> right, John Cub he's the he's the fine Southern gentleman lawyer, right? Yep. Who's uh, who's in the movie for maybe ten minutes? Right. I think he has more lines in the game than he does. Oh, look at those tiny ankles. His, like, that design, like, if, if you if you squashed it a little bit, it would just be like the evil business man's design in the Lorax. <laughs> oh, God. All, all of these movies have terrible character designs. Yep. Not, DreamWorks not has Shrek. never been good with their human characters. Not Shrek. Yeah, Shrek was okay. Shrek's perfect. Well, I, th I, th I think after Shrek, <laughs> they stopped going for, like, realistic-looking... Oh. <laughs> uh, I think after Shrek, they stopped going for, like, realistic-looking humans and went more stylized, which, on one hand, makes sense, because then you, you don't have that uncanny valley issue, but they always, do they always have the fucking worst human designs. Yep. Makes them less sexy. Do you have to do more chores? No, we're done. Oh, thank God. Yeah, we have to fight the final boss. Wait a minute. Is, is it Dark Guy? <laughs> I wish. That was really disconnected without the level, because I guess he won, but we didn't see it happen? 
Yeah, it's so dumb because there's like a ridge in all the other versions. There's like a infiltration level where you have to like go through that whole area. Then you fight all the hornets. Just take out those. Oh, well, I guess I guess you can't no, for, take out the... What? What the fuck? <laughs> Is that? We came at a bad time. Did Matthew Project get When murdered? we came back to that fucking face, it looked like a character design from Invader Zim. It was very disturbing. <laughs> I kind of look like the honeybee from Honey Nut Cheerios to me. I could go for some Cheerios right now. <laughs> 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 and some steakums. Oh man, what's your favorite kind of Cheerio? Apple Honey. cinnamon. Oh, you know Honey what? Honey Nut. That is a pretty good one. I. Uh, uh, the no, it's not. Apple cinnamon's really <laughs> good. Remember, Adam. they have peanut butter and chocolate, and that's pretty good. I haven't had the peanut butter and chocolate one. I forget. Is that a, was that actually Matthew Butterick? That was not. Kinda, it, oh, did it? It sounded kind of like him. That that sounded like it was pretty decent. Yeah, just Seinfeld, Warburton, and Goodman are the only ones that came back. Joe Goodman's pretty good about doing. That. I think in the not in the first season, but in the second season of um, The Emperor's New School, whatever the fucking terrible TV show based on The Emperor's New Groove, groove was, he came back to voice his character. Oh, yeah. okay. Which was good. Well, I mean, he's coming... Which I, I, I wonder if he'll, if he'll actually voice Sully in Kingdom Hearts Probably. 3. Probably. I mean, if he's doing that Roseanne reboot, might as well. Well, hey, I mean, I, I think I, th I think that's more like Rosanna's is the show that made him famous, so he's just kind of being good to the, the show. He's good yeah. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts is good. Kingdom Hearts is good with getting their voice actors back, so uh, I can not, see it. Not always, not always with like the movie stars. They're not. Most times they can't do that. <laughs> yeah, did you know that if if Woody is in is in any property that's not the movie, uh, Tim Allen's brother. <laughs> yes, Tim. Yes, Tim <laughs> Allen's brother. <laughs> 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 well, Tom, Tom Hanks. Well, Tom Hanks' brother voices Woody. Tom very, Allen. Very ironically, but Tim Allen's brother does the best Tom Hanks impression. What? <laughs> <laughs> if Tim Allen's brother was so good. Why was he canceled? Got a friend in me. That's my joke, and you stole it. <laughs> I'm suing you for everything. That joke was so good. How why, does, why, does, why, does, why does John Goodman's weapon look like the flamethrower whispering from Sonic Forces? <laughs> uh, oh, so this is take place before or after Sonic CD. They come the enemy, fuck them up. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just like John Goodman screaming. Nice watermark in the corner. You yeah, you should, <laughs> you should, you should, you should, it's the fun. You should have used the footage of his role in Arachnophobia, where he plays the fucking uh, exterminator with those wacky gas contraptions. I forgot about that. That movie's scary. All right. So wait a minute. So this is the last boss in the game. Yeah. But in the movie, there's still like. A lot left. The, the, spoiler alert: They they don't. The the fourth act is not in this game. What? Then what happens? They they just skip through over that. They're like, oh yeah, and that happened. <laughs> oh yeah, the world almost died because of me. But I mean, who cares? I punched John Goodman in the face. Seems fair to me. I wonder if Joe Goodman ever, like, played this game or, like, had his kids play this game and just saw this boss fight and just considered giving up acting altogether. <laughs> Aww. D Why doesn't he just fly out, fly away? Because he has to make him... Because he has to beat the shit out of the fat man. I'm just... Oh, I thought he was going to say bitch. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let John Goodman say <laughs> bitch. <laughs> right, it's like uh, for it. It's rated E for everyone until this part. Barry B. <laughs> bitching. <laughs> this is what happens when you find a stranger in the Alps. Bitch slaps him. I know. Just the fact that he just smacks a bee like that is hysterical. How is Barry not dead? He looks like that fat kid from Nightmare Before Christmas that's running away from the uh, jack-o'-lantern. Dude, that's messed up. He does, though. That's messed oh, up. Oh, man, concept art. 
Are you going to show that? <laughs> That's what Dave is excited about in this OP. Oh, man, concept art. <laughs> they had concept art lying around this courtroom. Yeah. Miyamoto is notorious for leaving Super Mario Brothers uh, concept art in courtrooms. Waka like, waka. Right, like, if Barry just went up to the top and hid, at some point somebody would come in there and he'd just fly away. I'm done. I, I, I hate bosses like this where it's literally like it's the exact same animation four times in a row. Like, I hate bosses that are, are like legit that lazy. Open and it was the exact same heart. spot. The, the targets were in the exact same spots, too. B? Together! I should have done, I should have done that. <laughs> Double boost! <laughs> He forgot. There is no effort in <laughs> these <forgot>. cutscenes. <laughs> these these cutscenes have like no sound effects or like no music. Oh, I heard a sound effect for half a second. Oh, oh, it's a lot. Buzz, of... buzz, buzzing's a sound effect. Sweet. Motion. Motion. <laughs> oh, you're gonna die. Uh, okay, that that look that looks a little. He's just doing a little pump. And you also when 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 you're shaking, you have to shake the Wii remote up and down. <laughs> so can you die? Like, if you get hit by his gas, can you actually die? If you lose all your life, then yeah. Oh. But you just but you, but you just like start over this section. You don't like well. I don't I don't I haven't died to this, so I don't know. I assume you just start over this section. It's not like Wait, a game over. Does your health uh, does your health um regenerate for the entire game or just in yeah, this level? Throughout, throughout this whole game. It's like Wolverine. So Jesus Christ, this game is made for babies. That's why it's that's why it's like impossible to die unless you like aren't paying attention at all. You mean you have to use your hands? That's like a baby <laughs> story. <laughs> <laughs> it's made for babies. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at him doing the, that move. He's pretty athletic. I'll give him that much. Oh, He's dead. Oh, you've just <laughs> murdered him. <laughs> <laughs> we murdered someone. But it's okay, he's a lawyer. He doesn't count as people. He's not moving, guys. <laughs> He's yeah. not saying anything. <laughs> uh, Barry, I oh God, Matthew Bro Broderick is there. Dad? Fuck. So that's For a second there, I thought, I thought there was going to be like a fucking Sonic and Lease cutscene where part of the wall gets put back together. Do get away! Do 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 you? So what was the point of showing the wall explode? Because they're talking about how, like, after everything that happened, the world almost destroyed, but then they got the flowers and everything was okay. Yes, because if we don't have flowers, the world will literally implode. I mean, wouldn't that be an interesting thing to do? Like, have that be the last level? <laughs> well, I'm... <laughs> uh, well, the, the, you'll, you'll see, but but the credits is, like, flying through a little area and, like, spraying, uh, spraying like, pollen all over some dead flowers. The but last... it's, like, really nothing. <laughs> the last <laughs> level takes place in a dystopian future where the world has ended. The B-movie um, game gets really fucking dark. Hey, hey. Uh, TJ is tweeting right now. <laughs> Pardon, what was that? TJ is tweeting. <laughs> TJ, stop <laughs> tweeting. Oh shit, fam, we stopped tweeting. Alright, yeah, let's go look at what he's tweeting. <laughs> I bet it's... T TJ, put it on screen now. <laughs> oh, bing! <laughs> <laughs> I bet that was a really good tweet. <laughs> that's, that's a good tweet. It wasn't. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it, was, it was a pretty bad tweet. Let's be fair. Okay. 
He restored. He's. How how bad do you think if DreamWorks had licensed mm -hmm. Sonic and made a movie in the mid two thousands? Oh. How bad do you think it would have been? Would have been really good. Why are you speeding through this? Slow it down fifty percent. Be, be, because be, because it because the credits is like ten minutes long. Because you gotta slow it down to half speed then. I, oh man, I would have loved to see a DreamWorks Sonic movie in the mid-2000s. It would have been awkward. It would have had celebrity voices. Um, oh god, you're right. It would have had, oh man, like who was really, like, popular in 2005? Jesse McCartney. Jesse McCartney. No, he wasn't. Yeah, he like... was. Beautiful Soul was, like, the song. But you were in... <laughs> Shut up, Aaron. <laughs> I don't want another pretty <laughs> face. I don't want just anyone to hold. Shia LaBeouf. Oh man, Shia LaBeouf. Oh my god. No, no, no but no, he, no, he wouldn't no, be no. Sonic. He would be the human Shia LaBeouf, friend of Sonic. Sh Shia LaBeouf got really big around 2007 with Transformers. It's a little bit early. No, but he was in I Robot with Will Smith. And that was 2004. True. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, I mean, he, he, was, he, he was in movies, but... He didn't become like a star to Transformers. Well, but Shia he... LaBeouf would play Shia LaBeouf would, would play Tails because he's oh still kind of young. That's in there. terrible. Yes, that would have happened. Shia LaBeouf would have played Tails. Shaq would be Knuckles. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Mr. T would be Doctor Eggman. Oh he god, wasn't yes. Big in 2005. <laughs> he's, he'd always be big. No, wait a minute. Except now he's gone. Kevin no, Spacey not. would be Dr. Eggman, so it'd be awkward as hell now. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, or because it's too that, or John Goodman as Dr. Eggman. Ooh. Possibly. John Goodman, it'd be really awkward, TJ, when it's about Kevin Spacey about kidnapping animals and keeping them in his, in his little air. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, it's like, this dude. film fucking aged badly. <laughs> red alert, red alert. I think that film would have aged badly the day it came out. <laughs> <laughs> So okay, I, I just Mike want to subject that because we're Mike oh, Myers. Man, so because because we're on the credits and because we're on this train of thought, do you think then in the upcoming Sonic movie they will keep the game cast or they'll be forced to uh, hire celebrities for that? I I think it will be some some will be celebrities and some will be the voice cast. I don't think there's any way that we'll get um, game cast Sonic. Like I think I think Sonic is a definite celebrity voice. I don't well, what? you know what I think Ratchet and Clank are yeah, the cape. I yeah. was and... Um oh well to, to be fair, Ratchet and Clank only kept Ratchet and Clank and Quark. So I mean it's it's I mean Oh and Nefarious. They they only would, recast a drag. Everybody else was new characters. I, I could see Yeah, but I, I think I think Sega wouldn't wouldn't think like that. They would just be like no, we have to get the biggest voice in Hollywood. <laughs> I don't know because I think I think I think at this point I, I think at this point Sega would understand that, um, that Sonic fans take their voice cast very seriously. So I think they would they would know that at least definitely like the, the American people who work at Sonic Team USA mm. would know that if like, the game cast were replaced with just random celebrities, um, the core the core fan base would not enjoy that. But then you, you could make the case that. Who gives a fuck as a Sonic fan? I, okay, I can see Roger Craig Smith remaining as Sonic because he was the Sonic in Wreck-It Ralph. I could see that being uh, a reason to keep him, but I could see the other cast going away. Set, unfortunately, I, I, I could see them replacing Eggman. That's the one I, I don't, don't want, want them right? to. Fucking Mike, Mike, I don't want him either. Mike but Pollock it, it's deserves. The Mike the Pollock after getting shunned with Wreck-It Ralph fucking deserves to do it on a big screen. Did you just say Mike the Pollock? Mike the Pollock. <laughs> You, you know, you know, you know. Oh. Confuse me. There was there was like additional voices actor called Mike Griffith. I was like, holy shit, they've melted together. <laughs> <laughs> Mike Mike Pollock deserves to be in more movies. I, I want him to be in a movie just so that he can like, so he can have to go to the like the red carpet and do all those interviews just to see what would happen. I think he did that Ooh. for um, bonus film clips. for I Cat in Paris. I think. Whoa, glass! Oh yeah, <laughs> it's such a great bit in the film. <laughs> yeah, keep on hitting that glass. Whoa! <laughs> oh, it's so good. Oh no, a bear! <laughs> no. 
Who's in the courtroom? Oh, who's, who's in the, the courtroom? courtroom? I'm the speed. <laughs> That reminds me of that Hamble Burris <laughs> skit where, or uh, that Eric Andre <laughs> skit where they bring a bear as a guest. Okay, and Hamble Burris just <laughs> loose. I oh. remember. Jen oh, to goes. win. No talking oh. to humans. Same law that makes uh, toys not talk to humans. Oh, man. If Toys R Us was so good, how <laughs> come <laughs> got banned? <laughs> 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 Have, have they officially shut down yet? Not the one near me. <laughs> he said uh, the thing. Oh! Oh, I guess that's it. The, and that's it. That's that everything. was the Ready Player what One. What about the David? Stefan, what about it, the concept art? Yeah, yeah. Go flip through it. I've got something else David's going to like. Oh, man. Is that like Kung Fu Panda game trailer? Game trailer. <laughs> I've been waiting for... Yes! <laughs> I've been waiting for this the whole time! <laughs> yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Oh, there he is. He sure is a panda. He's gonna learn kung fu. <laughs> and Activision's gonna teach him. I'm going to imagine they would play sort of those voice actors. Yeah. <laughs> you don't think Jack Black re reprises his role in Kung Fu Panda the game? Jack Black's in several video games. Oh, he yeah, was in uh, have, like, Legend. I thought that was Guitar have, like, Hero. No uh. They, they, oh, they is that might, Sonic physics? <laughs> they they might have gotten Jack Black, because he's the main character, but all the other ones, I can't see them getting them. They no, could have just used no, lines from the movie. No no joke, the Kung Fu Panda game is actually pretty decent. You no. know what's weird, though? I, I'm looking at it, and part, part of this is giving, is giving me Sonic Unleashed. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> and, and, this, and this came out in two, yeah, 2008. What? <laughs> So holy oh, shit! Holy these. shit, guys! The tenth anniversary of this game's coming up. Maybe we should do it up. No. <laughs> oh god. No. This <laughs> won't go home. <laughs> You've already said it, man. It, the <laughs> wheels just, are in motion. Just pretend you're. Just pretend you're playing Chunan. <laughs> you mean Chunan? What? A, it, it's all Greek to me. I wish Chun Li was you real. Fucking racist piece of shit. If Greece was so great, <laughs> how come we got cancelled? <laughs> <laughs> oh, if this, ga if this uh, game was so great, how come this playthrough is now cancelled? Oh. Well, if you stopped recording, then how come... Oh, I guess I'll... Together!